you're all doing well and today I'm really excited to be filming my October favorites for you guys. October was a really good month and I'll be sharing with you some of my beauty favorites and a few random favorites at the end of the video and um, I'm just really excited to be coming into the November month and then after that getting closer to the holiday season. So let's get started. The first item I have to share with you guys today is this concealer by NARS and this is the Radiant Creamy Concealer. And I just love this concealer. I'm in the color Light 2 Vanilla and this I just dot it on any blemishes and especially uh, underneath my eyes to cover up dark circles and this is just a beautiful finish. It's a sheen. Um, it really diffuses the darkness underneath the eyes. It is not heavy nor cakey. It's not drying on me and it lasts all day on me also. And I've just been really loving this concealer. My next favorite I have for you guys is actually a perfume by Atelier Cologne and it is in the scent Vanille Insensé and it looks like this. And the base notes in this is a vanilla from Madagascar, oak moss and amber and you have a touch of jasmine and lime also and this scent to me just creams fall. It's a sweet vanilla but also a clean fresh vanilla so it's not overly sweet like the um, Aquilina perfume, the pink sugar. And yeah, I definitely love this um, perfume and Atelier Cologne do really great perfumes in terms of staying power. I get whiffs of it during the day and um, I really recommend you guys smelling this if ever you are into vanilla scents. My next favorite for October has been this beautiful, sleek, sophisticated Marc Jacobs eyeshadow palette in the Lolita. And this is a beautiful neutral palette. It comes with a nice mirror and these are the shades. And so you have a mixture of shimmery eyeshadows in here and matte eyeshadows. You have this gorgeous color here that I love to wear as a highlighting shade and it is a creamy white vanilla. Then I, you have this beautiful matte brown shade which you can use in your eyebrows. You have this dark deep brown that you can use for eyeliner. You have this beautiful shimmery um, light pink shade. Uh, you have also another light iridescent champagne shade. This is beautiful. Um, but the two that I have been loving are these two shades here. I don't know if you'll be able to tell. But they are a light peach sheen one. I'll try and swatch it for you guys here. And this rosy coppery sheen shade. So these two together make the perfect eye look and I have been wearing this, no joke, almost every day this month. Um, they're so creamy, they're highly pigmented, they're a dream to blend on the eyes and I've been really really enjoying this palette. The next item I have for you guys is actually another eyeshadow and it's by Laura Mercier and it is this shade called Café Au Lait and it is a beautiful, as the name says, café color, a beautiful brown and this is just the your perfect crease color. It's absolutely stunning and I um, first saw this in, I think it was Lisa Lisa D1 did a video about it and she mentioned this and I just had to go get it. So here's a swatch. I think Laura Mercier makes the best mass matte eyeshadows. They're just a dream to blend. They're really creamy and pigmented and I've been really enjoying this color for the fall. My next favorite has been the new holiday Amazonian clay blush in the off the cuff palette by Tarte. 
and it looks like this. And this is just an absolutely gorgeous palette. I have actually have a video that I posted a review with some swatches, so I'll link that below so you guys can check it out. But it's been, I've been wearing this almost every day in October also. Um, the variety of shades is gorgeous, especially this shade here. It's a nice mauve color for the fall. And I've been wearing this matte bronzer called Park Avenue Princess also just to bronze up the face and then applying one of the blushes. So I've just been really enjoying this palette. The next item I have for you guys is by Burberry and this is the number 7 light glow blush in the color Earthy. And this I've been loving for the fall season. It's just this beautiful medium brown rosy color. It's beautiful, it's creamy, it's very pigmented. Um, I'll try and give you a swatch here. I don't know if you can see this. But Temptalia did a review on it so I'll link it below. She gave it an a minus and I just find that Burberry blushes are so finely milled uh, the textures are so soft and creamy and they last on my cheeks for about nine hours uh, easily so I really recommend these blushes. My next October favorite is this beautiful Essie nail polish called Angora Cardi and it's this soft rosy purpley plum color um, it applies darker on the nails and I've just been wearing this a ton this month. It's the perfect plum shade for fall and I've just been really loving this. Continuing with the plum raspberry shades, I've been loving this beautiful Marc Jacobs uh, lip gloss and this is in the color Studded Kiss and it's just absolutely stunning. It's this fuchsia berry shade and has some shimmers in it. I'll give you a swatch. And this is a semi-opaque shade, but it can be built up. So it looks like this. And this does not settle into the lips. It's a great creamy formula and it lasts on me for about 8 hours. And um, Temptalia also did a review on these lip gloss, so I'll link also that below. My next October favorite has been uh, this beautiful Laura Mercy lipstick that looks really scary into the tube, but it's just absolutely gorgeous. It goes on sheer and it's this flattering pinky purpley shade. I'll give you a swatch here. And it looks like this. And seriously, uh, these, they're called the Stick Gloss, and this is the color Black Orchid. Um, these are so creamy and they're so moisturizing. They leave a beautiful high gloss shine on the lips, so you don't need to pair this, so you don't need to pair them with a gloss. They're already really glossy on their own, and these do not dry out my lips. My next favorite is a few things from Bath & Body Works. Actually, I've been loving candles during the month of October. I think it just makes your room cozy and smells great. And I've been particularly liking this one by Bath & Body Works called Pumpkin Carrot Cake. And it's this gorgeous orange shade and it doesn't necessarily smell like pumpkin carrot cake. I just love this. It smells like vanilla, creamy, um, bakery scent so if you're into sweet bakery vanilla type scents you would love this one and my next favorite by Bath & Body Works has been a moisturizing hand soap and it's actually the gentle foaming hand soap in the scent pumpkin cupcake and for the fall I mean look at the packaging it just looks gorgeous in my bathroom and I mean who doesn't like pumpkins and cupcakes so I've been really liking this one and my last random favorite for you guys is actually a food item. I've been loving these Cinnamon Jacks brown sugar cereals. Um, they're called the Cinnamon Jacks 
So brown sugar and cinnamon flavor and it's exactly what they taste like. Cinnamon and brown sugar. So if you like sweet cinnamon cereals, you'll love these also. That's it guys. Those are all my October favorites. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a comment below telling me what your October favorites has been. I would love to know and I love talking to you guys. And don't forget to thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it. And please don't forget to subscribe. It means a lot to me and I'll be filming more videos soon. So thank you so much for watching guys. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!